friends. Happy fancy day. Look how fancy I got today for you guys. Look, I got a headband. I have a headband on. I have a, look, a necklace and a fancy shirt. This was actually Miss Christmas fancy shirt. She let me borrow it. Um, I didn't see her. She let me borrow it a long time ago. We're still social distancing, but I got super fancy for you guys. Um, this is as fancy as I can get. You know me. I'm not the fanciest kind of person, but I was so excited to get fancy today with you guys. So I hope you guys are in your nice fancy outfits and let's get ready to work on our writing. This is so exciting. Okay. So you need your folder with your web and the first draft that we did yesterday. So if you don't have your web and your first draft and a pencil, I need you to pause the video and when you come back, we're gonna get started. So yesterday we worked on our first draft and we took our web and we picked one of our um, ideas from our web to write a sentence about. So today we're gonna pick another idea from our web and we're gonna add to our story um, so that the reader really has an idea of why we think this is the best season of the year. So I already used birthday and I know I already used it because I circled it. So that means I already used it. So what do I have left? I have beach, sun, and vacation. Well, I'm really missing the sun right about now because it's been rainy a lot and cloudy. So I think I'm going to use sun. So I'm going to circle the sun because that means that I'm using it. So now what I have to do is I have to think of a sentence that goes with my topic. So my topic is that summer is the best season. How can I take the word sun and make it a sentence so my reader knows that I think summer is the best season. So don't forget our four um, steps that we take in the writing process. Think it, say it, write it, read it. So now I'm gonna think. I might need a minute. Hmm. Got it. So here's my sentence. The sun makes me happy. And it does. When the sun's out and bright and shining on my face, actually, you know what? But that, that doesn't really have to do with summer. I should say the hot sun because the sun's out in the wintertime too. Think about it. Lots of times we would sit outside. We would sit in the classroom and we'd see the sun shining so bright, right? And then we would get outside on the playground and it was freezing because just because the sun is out doesn't mean it's hot. So I want my reader to know that the, the hot sun makes me happy. I mean, the sun always makes me happy, but the hot sun makes me super. Maybe I should say that. The, oops, my necklace. The hot sun makes me super happy. So now I have seven words, but also my reader knows that it's not just the regular sun, it's the hot sun. And it makes me super duper happy. So you think of your sentence now. Take one of your ideas from your web and think of your sentence. Hmm. Got it? All right. What I want you to do is pause the video and do your best to write your own sentence. And remember the, the rules that we talked about. Start with a capital letter, end with punctuation. And I know you guys have been working on punctuation with Miss Chrisman in Word Study, so you know what that is. That's also college word. Stretch out your sounds. Think of the best sentence you can. Pause the video, and when we come back, I'll have I'll read you my sentence, and you can me read me your sentence. I'm gonna read you what I wrote, and I actually added another word while I paused it. I was thinking, how could I make this even better? So listen to the word I added: the hot summer sun. Oops, I made a mistake. This is why we read it. Look, the hot summer sun make me. That doesn't make sense. And also look, I made a mistake here. If I had an eraser, I would erase it. I made two mistakes, totally fine. So the hot summer sun makes, had to add the S, me, see how I made a mistake? Ooh, it's okay though, we fix our mistakes. The hot summer sun makes me super happy. See how I added the word summer so that my reader knew that I was talking about the hot summer sun, not just the regular sun that's out all the time, that super hot summer sun. Like as soon as you go outside, it's like whoosh, this heat hits your face. 
Love it, guys. My absolute favorite. So I made a couple mistakes, but I fixed it, which you guys are, were totally cool with. It's totally normal to make mistakes. That's why we have erasers. I use a marker so you guys can see, so I don't have an eraser, but again, totally fine. So, and good thing I read it, right? Because I, I had made a couple mistakes and then I just fixed it. So let's read everything together. Summer is the best season. My birthday is in the summer. The hot summer sun makes me super happy. And I put an exclamation point because I was so excited to tell my, my reader that, that sentence. So your job is to read your sentences to someone in your house or to yourself. Look for any mistakes that you might have made and fix them. And then tomorrow we're going to add, I think, one more sentence and then edit it. So remember, edit is when you like add things and fix things and look for mistakes. So tomorrow will be our maybe last day of writing and editing. So we're almost done to publish. Um, I hope you enjoyed our fancy day today. So fancy, look, I'm so proud of my necklace. Oh, wrong way. I'm so proud of my necklace, guys. I never accessorize. Um, but it was fun to get fancy with you all today. Uh, I miss you all very much. And I feel like I talked a lot today. So I'm going to say goodbye now and see you tomorrow.